गुड मॉर्निंग डियर स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू कंटिन्यू विथ क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवनटीन ऑफ वार्म अप एक्सरसाइज सो लेट्स रीड द क्वेश्चन और स्कूल वांट्स टू प्लांट सम ट्रीज इन फिफ्टी थ्री रोज द गार्डनर बॉट फाइव थाउजेंड नाइनटीन सैपलिंग्स फ्रॉम अ नर्सरी हाउ मेनी लीज नंबर ऑफ सैपलिंग्स शुड ही ब्रिंग मोर सो दैट ईच रो हैज सेम नंबर ऑफ ट्रीज so let's do this question number of rows equals to how many rows 53 number of saplings the gardener bought equals to 5019 more saplings required so that each row has a क्वल नंबर ऑफ सैपलिंग्स डू दिस वट विल डू वी विल डिवाइड फाइव थाउजेंड नाइनटीन बाई फिफ्टी थ्री सो डिवाइड इट फाइव थाउजेंड नाइनटीन बाई फिफ्टी थ्री सी यू डू द डिविजन इन द रफ पार्ट आफ्टर डिविजन विल गेट द क्वेश्चन एज नाइंटी फोर and the remainder as 37 therefore more saplings required equals to see how many rows are there 53 so 53 minus remainder will be subtracted 37 So fifty three minus thirty seven is sixteen saplings. Clear? So what will you do? You will be doing the division and writing the quotient and remainder, and remainder will be subtracted by the number of rows. So this much of saplings. This is the least number of saplings required, so that each row will have the same number of saplings. Okay? Now let's move to Let's move to question number eighteen. See here, I'll explain this question in book only. Okay. See here, fill in the missing numbers in the factor tree given below. Okay. See here, one twenty and the fact factors of one twenty are sixty into what makes one twenty sixty into two, one twenty. Okay. Similarly. What are the factors of sixty? Thirty into what? What are the factors of sixty? Thirty into two is sixty. So again two. Similarly, ten into what makes thirty? Three. And two into what makes ten? Five. Clear? Similarly here, two into what makes seventy-eight? Two into what makes seventy-eight? Thirty-nine. Clear? And three into what makes thirty-nine? Thirteen. Like this you have to do. Clear? Let's move to question number nineteen. Here, question number nineteen. Ten pence cost rupees one fifty four. Find the cost of one pence. So what will you do? One hundred fifty four will be divided by ten. Clear? You'll get the cost of one pence is rupees fifteen point four. Clear? Rupees fifteen point four. So you do the division and get the answer. Okay. Now. Let's move to question number twenty. See here, thirteen upon twenty-three plus two upon twenty-three. See here, the denominators are same, so take a common twenty-three. Now, thirteen plus two is how much? Fifteen. Add and write it. Similarly, question number B. Both the denominators are same here, so take a common twenty-seven. Now, twenty-five minus twelve, how much? Thirteen. Clear? Now, two two upon five of one kg. 
टू अपॉन फाइव ऑफ वन के जी सो हियर वी कैन डू टू अपॉन फाइव टू अपॉन फाइव इन टू वन के जी इक्वल्स टू वन थाउजेंड क्लियर सो फाइव जो फाइव फाइव टू जो टेन जीरो जीरो सो टू इंटू टू फोर हंड्रेड ग्राम क्लियर क्लियर स्टूडेंट दो हैव नॉट अंडरस्टूड दिस वी कैन डू इन दर ऑनलाइन क्लास ओके नाउ लेट्स मूव टू क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी वन स्टूडेंट्स अटेंडिंग ऑनलाइन क्लास इज वेरी मच कंपलसरी फॉर ऑल ऑफ यू ओके यू हैव टू अटेंड ऑल द ऑनलाइन क्लासेस सो दैट योर डाउट्स विल बी क्लियर ओके नाउ क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी वन पूनम बॉट ट्वेल्व मीटर फोर्टी सेंटीमीटर रिबन एंड डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड इट इक्वली अमंग फोर गर्ल्स हाउ मच रिबन डिड ईच ऑफ द गर्ल्स हैव ओके लेट्स डू इट हियर क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी वन सोल्यूशन लेंथ ऑफ रिबन बॉट इक्वल्स टू ट्वेल्व मीटर फोर्टी सेंटीमीटर वी कैन कन्वर्ट ट्वेल्व मीटर फोर्टी सेंटीमीटर इंटू सेंटीमीटर ऑनली सो ट्वेल्व मीटर फोर्टी सेंटीमीटर कैन बी रिटर्न एज वन थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड फोर्टी सेंटीमीटर क्लियर नाउ रिबन डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड equally among four girls what can we do 1240 cm divided by 4 see once you are dividing we'll get 43012 four ones are 4 4 zero is a zero so 310 cm ribbon Each girl will get okay, or three meter ten centimeter. Clear? Therefore, each girl, each girl will get three meter. Ten centimeter ribbon. Clear? Now question number twenty-two. Look at the clock, which shows two fifteen p.m. and answer the following questions. See, this clock is showing the time. It's two fifteen p.m. What time will it be after two hours thirty minutes? What you can do? You can add two hours thirty minutes. To two fifteen p.m. So here, what we can do, we can convert, we can convert two fifteen p.m. into twenty four hour clock. So two fifteen will be fourteen fifteen hours. Okay. Now you can add two hours thirty minutes to this to get this answer, and here nine hours forty five minutes to this to get this answer. Similarly, in question number B. You can subtract three hours thirty minute here and one hour fifty minute from this. Okay, so it's very simple. You can do it. Now let's move to question number twenty three. See here, what are the parameters of shape A and shape B? What you can do to get the parameter, we can count number of units: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So here it is fourteen units. Shape B: One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. So it is eighteen units. These are very simple. That's why we are doing it quite fast. Now let's move to question number twenty-four. Study the patterns and write next three terms. Next three terms. See, find the difference between these two. 
3 and 6, the difference is of 3. 6 and 12, the difference is of 6. See here, the difference is of 12. So, what is the difference we are finding? 3, 6, 12. It is becoming double. Now, what is the double of 12? 24. So, 24 will be added to 24. 48. What is the difference here? 24. 24. What is the double of 24? 48. 48 plus 48. How much? 48 plus 48. 96. What is the double of 96? 192. Like this. Okay. Similarly, 2, 3, 4, 5. Differences of 3. 6, 7, 8, 3. 3. So, 11 plus 3? 14. 14 plus 3? 17. 17 plus 3? 20. Like this. Okay. Now, here... See, 1, 8, 27, 64. See here, what is the cube of 1? 1 into 1 into 1 equals to 1 only. So, write 1. So, 2 into 2 into 2 is how much? 2 to the 4, 4 to the 8. 8 is here. Now, 3 into 3 into 3 equals to 3 to the 9 and 3 to 27. 27. See, it is here. See here again, it is the cube of 4. What is the cube of 5? 125. Cube of 5. What is the cube of 6? 216. What is the cube of 7? 343. So, like this, you have to write. Clear? Now, let's move to question number 25. See here, you have to read this graph and answer the following. See, so this graph shows different games played by students. Okay? Means, favorite games of the different students. So, what does this graph show? This graph shows the favorite games played by students. So, you can write the heading only, favorite games. How many students play badminton? Badminton, how much? 7. So, write 7. What is the most popular game? Most popular game is cricket. It is played by most number of the students, 10. So, you can write the answer, cricket. Again, at least how many students were surveyed? So, you can add 6, 8, 10, 7 and again 7. So, add all 7 plus 7, 14, 14 plus 11, 25, 25 so, total students are 39. Let's add it once again. 7 plus 10, 14. 115 plus 10, 25. 25 plus 8, 33. 33 plus 6, 39. So, total number of students were 39 only. Okay. So, the, here we are completing warm-up exercise. And in the next class, next day, we will start chapter number 1. Okay. Thank you.